submitting my finals, like my last final. That's really good, so. It is my last class before my last semester of college. Well, technically, like I have um, one winter session class, but at the moment I'm running late to my final in-person class before my final semester of college. And that's so exciting to me. Um, I'm wearing this. Oh. I don't know if you can see it, it's just like white, this like square neck top, um, not white, like neutral black jeans. And then because it is literally December, and the last time I uh, recorded was literally the first day of school in September, it is cold out, so I'm leaving with wet hair to go to campus. And then I'm gonna go finish my finals in the Cambridge Library because I don't really feel like spending $10 on coffee to sit in a room, you know? Um, yeah, that's where I'm going. I just got home from my final in-person class of 2021 and it was less than an hour long and then I left. Um, but I won something on campus for like following their dining hall account and I got like a free coffee tumbler thing and I live off campus and I drink a lot of coffee so this is gonna be good. Even though I like bring to work and stuff and this one has, it says like one of those things where you can like close the, close the top. And the one that, oh, it's blue, that's so nice. The one that I currently have is like, like just like a regular one, but it like doesn't close at the top. And this one has like a little thing where you can close it and it's nice. So that's fun. Um, was not expecting it to be blue, but it's whatever, I guess. And then I got home and I got a package. Like I didn't order anything. I guess my parents sent me something. I don't know what this could have been. Like I asked, <laughs> I asked my mom to send me multivitamins because I'm like, I don't want to get sick. Um, Cause I've like, the seasons changed and my like throat started hurting. And I was like, I don't want to like become gravely ill um, during winter and not be able to go home for Christmas. And she sent me a bunch of like emergency, but like the gummies. And I was like, could you send me multivitamins? So this could be multivitamins. I'm going to open it. Oh my gosh, it is multivitamins. She sent me little critter multivitamins, like the kids ones. Um, so that's nice. Now you have vitamins. Ow. I don't, how am I supposed to open this? I just opened it and I looked at the serving size and it said one gummy vitamin for children ages two to three and then two for children ages four and older. So that's fun. It's <laughs> it's literally just two gummy bear vitamins. Um, and I just think it's really funny that my parents eat these as well at home. I mean, they're vitamins, but I don't know. It tastes good. I don't know, it's kind of concerning. I'm the president of an organization on campus. I think I talked about it like a little bit last semester, like when I was doing videos a little bit more consistently or at least more consistently than I have this semester. Um, and running, like last semester there was a VP, but like I didn't really allocate a lot of like job stuff to them. And this semester that person didn't come to campus because of mental health reasons. Um, and there was a new vice president and I didn't allocate like any responsibility other than like post it on our website every once in a while. And she's like, okay. And then this semester, this next semester, because it's my final one, we need to find like a president, right? Yeah. So we thought it was going to be the regular VP and she's like, I'm gonna be focusing on grad school. Like I'd love to still be a part of the organization as a vice president, but I could not move up to president. So <laughs> we like had like vice president meetings 
or like interviews to like get a new vice president to be co-vice president with the girl who's currently vice president. So then when I graduate, the new VP will move to VP, like the president position, you know? I hope it makes sense. But anyways, I sent out the emails like just now to be like, hey, congratulations. Like you're a new, like you're on the e-board basically. So like a handful of people showed interest, but like three or four of them actually filled out the required like stuff to be interviewed, right? Um, so we interviewed all of them last week. We knew from the start who was gonna be like the best candidate for the position. And we interviewed a few others and we're like, well, this main person that we first interviewed is like more qualified than the others, even though these people really want to be a part of it and they're qualified whatever we want them in the board in some way so one of the girls is vp we like all the emails i sent out at once one of the girls is a marketing coordinator person because technically i'm the marketing director as the president so like you know and then there's a graphic team department head and like as the organization like we create publications each semester and this person who's the graphics head now um designed the entire book this past semester like organized everything did a fantastic job it's a beautiful publication but i just like allocated different things and then i got one email from someone who i thought was like the per like the vice president girl so i was like oh my gosh here's all, all the information that you need to know and I, I sent it in a few seconds like literally like past the undo state i was like oh my god it's not the right person like i said the email's the wrong person so then i sent another email but i did like voice to text because like it was on my phone and I was doing something else, bad idea. Um, <laughs> and like in this moment, I was like, I'm so sorry. I, it is completely my fault. I should not be doing this on my phone. And she's like, literally don't even worry about it. I'd be happy to take the position. She just wanted more information on the, on the uh, marketing coordinator position because it's like a new one. And she's like, literally you're overqualified, like literally so overqualified, but um, hopefully everyone accepts the positions and the vice president person who was interested takes it because she was anyways you have you you don't really care but this is like what's been going on recently um i put coffee in this and i'm really excited to drink it um i'm gonna put my stuff in my bag and then go to the bank and deposit money from this past week that i got at work and then go to the library i've never been to this library like i had said before so We'll see how this goes. Also, I have this full of coffee and I have a Celsius in my bag. Do you ever have the feeling, regardless of how little cold brew you consume, you immediately have to shit? Like immediately, immediately after you take a sip. Or is that just me? I don't know. It could just be a me thing, but. I'm at the train now, but like I have not really started my finals. And one of them I'm like really worried about because I just really didn't know what I was writing for it. And then I read through it and I was like, this literally makes no sense and it's not cohesive and it's due at midnight. And I'm just terrified that I'm gonna submit it and he's gonna be like, what the hell is this? And I'm gonna be like, well, I wish I could tell you. The final that's due tonight is a 10 page research paper. I literally did not start the research until last night. I had the sources and everything. I somehow am using like three pages from a previous essay and just incorporating it, but I'm just like, it literally is going to go very poorly. And he's just like, get 10 pages down. I'm like, well, I need to get at least an eight out of 10 on this assignment to like keep the grade that I have in the class. So I'm hoping I don't lose that much for the incompetence that I'm putting on this paper. I'm making soup 
and I'm trying a Progresso one I have not tried. It is the wild rice one with chicken and I've not had it. My friend said it's really good, so. Anyways, the last clip that you saw of me like with my computer, oh my God, the lighting is so bad. The last clip you saw of me with me and my computer is me submitting my finals, like my last final. That's like an essay. Literally started research for one of them yesterday. I truly don't know how I wrote like 11 pages of research, but I did it. Um, so I'm gonna eat my soup and watch Bob's Burgers because it's all I've been watching recently. It is the next day and I'm at my boyfriend's place and I just got dressed and we're gonna go to Target to get Christmas stuff, but I'm gonna end it here because I really don't feel like putting more than one day in it right now. So we're gonna do that and I already have like a lot. Yeah, goodbye. Okay, so I know yesterday I recorded and I was like, I don't have to record anything else. Well, I lied because I have one more final to do. So I'm going back to the library. I don't even know if you can hear any of this. There's like a bus is in a highway next to me basically, or like a freeway or whatever. I'm going to the Cambridge Public Library again. And I'm just gonna sit there until I finish my final. And I found out last night from one of my classmates that the professor's not coming back. She's not, a, they're not even like a professor. They're like, they're not tenured, which is why they're not a professor. But like, it's so sad. They're like one of the better professors I've had at Emerson or teachers I've had at Emerson. And like two out of the three of the professors I've had this semester are like leaving and cause they're like, I don't wanna have anything to do with it. I'm on my way. It's kind of gross outside. The last shot smells like laundry or like a dryer sheet. Just thought I'd put that out there because I was standing next to probably a laundry room near Harvard. So thought like the school, a Harvard square, but like the school specifically. two weeks later from my finals and I started another class that I think I had mentioned like earlier but yeah I'm like two weeks into the class which means I ended the semester two weeks ago um it's almost 2022 which is very weird to think about um and I'm gonna try to be consistent next year or like this next semester because I want to document the rest of my senior year which I said I was gonna do in September and then I did not do that so let's hope that with all that I'm doing that I'll be able to do that as well and if I could do it this past spring with like a full schedule I could definitely do it this semester with three classes and a thesis totally right yeah um it is currently like midnight so I'm gonna go to bed um thank you for watching and I'll see you next time